It's January 9th, 2013. I'm Brian Bishop, and I like smooth jazz. This is 90 Seconds on the Verge, presented by Ford. We've gotten our first look at Microsoft Surface Pro. The tablet has a 10.6-inch 1080p display and uses the same kind of kickstand and keyboard cover scheme as the Surface RT. It's thicker and heavier than the cheaper model, but you get the added advantage of running Windows 8 Pro. We found the tablet to be extremely fast in our tests, but that comes at a price. We estimate the tablet will have only five hours of battery life. The Surface Pro will be available for purchase later this month, starting at $899. Gabe Newell has a vision for your living room, and it's called the Steam Box. The Valve co-founder sat down with us for an exclusive interview. He doesn't see the Steam Box as the device will be tied to just one room. Instead, Newell says it will be able to serve content to up to eight different television screens. The company has high hopes for different kinds of input as well, including biometric data and gaze tracking. Motion controllers like the Kinect, however, don't appear to be in the cards. And yes, he still hates Windows 8. The unicorn of smartwatches finally has a release date. The Pebble e-paper watch will start shipping out to Kickstarter backers starting January 23rd. The device links to your phone via Bluetooth and can display notifications when you receive calls, emails, or text messages. The company will slowly fill out standing orders as it ramps up production. You can pre-order the Pebble for $150. And those are today's top stories. Join us tomorrow when we'll be reviewing the best beverages of CES. Verge Coffee.